So hello everybody and welcome back to Empire's Ender. Today we're playing as Gene Thief and today we're going to trap I to see who who will win? Counterparts or Gene Thief. Now one thing. These guys will be off. there and yep yep everything all our food resources are are great good old jelly beans and we need the, that food resource so we'll save just in case the game crashes just in case the game crashes for no reason but i don't think there's a point to save so I want to check. I went to check my audio, and yeah, it's doing fine. So probably. So sorry about that. That plus my doorbell was ringing, so I had to go answer it. So first thing, if you were a little small, little call me. Get food, and that's exactly what we're about to do. And we need to delete some food chambers just to deal with this thing. These things, and I don't like these things at all because the they food. kill really bad. And they are really bad things that like you don't want your colony. So it's easy for the rest of the colonies just to see what the rest of the colonies are doing with an app. We're gonna see the health bars, and they're still doing fine. But they're killing lots of stuff while green is having a hard time, hard time surviving. Because, because AI, other AI are smarter than. Because there's AI that are smarter than the dark. Yeah, and you guys can attack? Why did I turn you off attack? Yep, the spit at him. <laughs> Just cannon fodder him. And this is usually the place for wood ants to go to. Because, yeah, this is the place for wood ants. And, yeah. The beach is usually where wood, the wood ants live. But, um, yeah. Uh, the smart the swamp map still hasn't or the swamp map hasn't gotten released in free play except the fire ants have which is weird how comes the smart the the swamp the fire ants have been released but not the swamp I know they're gonna update the thing and make and make um put on free play because why wouldn't they do that what's the point of the update if they're not going to do that anyway so yeah that's my so that's the question 
we should be asking each other that question if we don't think. But I'm serious. There's no possible way there's not going to add that to the game. Maybe in free play. It's true. But, um, Slug Disco, they're still busy in whatever. I forgot what place they were they went to, so for like game devs and stuff. So your but it's basically where your favorite game devs are. If you don't know. Your favorite game devs go there. I forgot what place it's called. I'll look up in Twitter. Anyway. But today's their last day at that place, and I, and that's probably why they haven't been, you haven't heard anything from Slug Disco, except on Twitter. If you want to just see Slug Disco, you have to go on Twitter. And this guy has been growing too high on population, I just wonder if my eye light is just finds its ways to hack the game. I put, I cancel, I remove him from hack mode, and he's off, and I expect him to be off hack mode, but he's still on hack mode. Why? I mean, you put on easy begun. difficulty, but easy difficulty, it takes a few minutes to, to grow strength and numbers, and Yep, that guy is going to get rinsed. Okay. Because it's one half of each. So as soon as the difficulty reaches to at least a hundred, then we should be able to... With the... when you're playing with the counterparts, but yeah. We're no longer counterparts. We're gene fees. And gene fees are technically the counterparts, but with different ad species. Which is weird, because they have the same queen. I'm just, and I'm just saying, army ants, how come they haven't added army ants to the game? Like, they have added it for counterparts, but... For counterparts, but why didn't they add real army ants? That's my question, Slug Disco. I won't be asking the question, because I don't think we'll ever figure out. Unless Slug Disco is actually watching the video. Which is less possible to happen, but you know. And we have so much more fire ants than anything else because they're so cheap to make. So the colony is starving. There's not enough food to feed the new brood. You think this colony is starving? Look at what we're doing right now. We're not starving. We're getting food, hatching the lost ones or lost ones and that are gonna get reborn and then this. The battle has begun. And then yeah. We'll just get these guys killed. Easy, see? Easy, easy. Lamb man. And squeezy. Okay. And I won't say that again, because and I won't say that again because I just don't like that word, that phrase. I don't like the word, phrase, and I don't know why I said it if I don't like the phrase. But you know, oh my gosh! Oh, jeez! You got to be taunting me. What the heck? You have to have that much of them there? Okay. Well, this is gonna be... This is probably going to be the... The way to get lots of food, because... Jeez. If 
this looks like he lungs, kind of. What the hell? What? This looks like lungs. This is what ant chambers normally would not look like, but I'm just saying. These are the nursery workers. The, the actual nursery workers are actually the, what the queen made. But the thing is that, what's funny is that the life cycle, they actually start with three workers. Why can't we start with the zero workers and then, and then the queen has to use the suit to act? This colony is, this colony is thriving to become a big, huge colony actually so far because this colony has not had a single, com like a single challenge with anything. Actually, the only challenging thing was trying to get the fish and nothing else. The thing is that only to realize that we're not going to get a other fish um, and yeah that's kind of painful how the, must the game themselves. doesn't spawn another fish but yeah oh no oh no oh no stop oh no you're very close to the queen i don't like how close your fate how close you're close to the workers the workers in this game. Size 13 looks like. Yeah. Okay. Good size. And now we actually have 20 workers working inside instead of 19. So at least it's less painful than for the workers. Because at least there's one more worker. Goes up the mountain is not the greatest resource to come to. So we'll upgrade the fire ants first because they're cheaper. Unlike the wood ants that cost literally sixty dollars to just and I, I <laughs> no sixty food, not the dollars. Now by now the other colonies better have valuables better be going outside unlike uh green can't handle like the not having the cheat green is like uh what's the point of life without cheating okay what's inside their nest i just want to see how they're doing in their nest and i and i'll just make them work i'll make them I gotta make them hatch all their numbers so bad because there's no way this thing. They better be staying inside for a reason. Plus, this is easy for them. This is easy difficulty. Me, I playing medium and I'm surviving this. And my ally is playing medium too. He's surviving this. How are you not surviving this? And then. He is playing easy, and he, and he is arriving. You can't even go... Pathetic. I can not imagine a colony with no, not be able to beat anything on easy difficulty. This, you can't beat a free play on easy? Wow. I mean, you're AI, but still, you should be able to do something. Okay, and I made you, okay, now I made you stronger again. Okay, and now run out there. Okay, yeah. Oh. Okay, 
this is the war against spiders. Go! This is the spider war. Go, guys. Fight them. Spit on them. Go. This is a whole bunch of wolves. This is two wolves by three wolves spiders. And he's... But we're still gonna win, and yeah, <laughs> look at all that food. Gee, Anyone that keeps that will die will go there. Anyone that bleh, that is just closer to here will go here. Will make them circle because they don't have to. So they don't have to revolve over everywhere. But some people will go to the, the longest shortcut for some reason. But sometimes the shortcuts could be pain. Shortcuts are usually painful because for when you're playing as deep cutters. Because... Sometimes, yeah, you get the, because sometimes your refuse are right at the shortcut, and they go there. Fine, but I know, but, but lucky we're not playing as leaf cutters. <laughs> 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 he, he's just killing What, why is he, why is he doing this? Like, Green has finally gone inside. Oh, so I see, um, they want to come. They only come out at daytime because that's the only time that it's easier for them, I guess. And I attacked yellow to make him get royal guards, so he doesn't, so he doesn't end up being a useless colony. And I actually helped him a lot, so yeah. And I left just in case red decides to be a revolt because you don't want that. And yep, now we can be out. Now we're just a now we're just a big colony. And now we need to, we need to continue upgrading until we reach the to the point we can start making leaf cutters. We have a strong. Oh, okay. uh, because a good colony will make everything fair for everyone, except workers, because they need the last thing. Oh, yeah, they ate it, but he died in the course of saving farmers from pests because um aphids like aphids they kind of um destroy farmers work so yeah This is a strong colony, but um, we need to get the food faster going because, you know, we're. Because this is a 92 ant colony. We need at least enough to survive. This guy. Both colonies are trying to prepare for the Ubers, which I think are coming soon after a few seconds. So. You guys better prepare for the boss level. Because it's like playing fan. You're trying to wait for fan Thanos to come. But Thanos is not gonna come anytime. Even if this is not Thanos. <laughs> And I 
understand why people always go for fire ants. They're just, they just make your colony so big. Neat. They really do. They really make your colony just big as heck. So this chamber might be filled with fire ants, because I really think fire ants will help our colony just grow to 200 soldiers. And yeah. What ads haven't done anything to do the straw? So, yeah. It, and the good thing about level threes is the splash damage, baby. So, we'll actually just do this because we can. As I can, and yes, no more defenses, no more of this, just have more, no more defensive, let's have defensive, let's just have this, and yes, and any time an Uber is going to come, any second, any second, maybe not any second. Uber. And yes. 
So to see what the other colonies are doing. And we'll see if I... Oh. Uh, that's not a... But that's not over the kill. Because they killed that thing. So, if we have to go find the Uber. Uber, as he said, the Uber is over here. Hopefully this counts. The Uber is over here. Uh, it's time to fight this big creature. What are you guys continuously fighting? Oh, I thought it was something big. Where's that big thing? Oh my god. Oh jeez, that thing is huge. And it's next to these guys? Cause oh my god. And no, I don't like this at all. I don't like this at all. Revolt from here the so revolt from here. Your spinners, if you guys are coming. Because it doesn't even seem like you guys are. Oh my. Go! Go! Kill it! Go! Kill it! Go! Oh my god. This thing is slicing everyone. Mostly the fire ants are getting killed because they're the weakest to come across. Ah, yeah. And we survive. With each challenge met head on, this colony has proved itself time and time again. Its growth is now unstoppable. I'm gonna play more and instead of ending the mission. And how do you feel after losing, idiot? If oh my god, that wasn't actually e that wasn't actually hard or easy, but it, I was expecting it to make us lose a lot of food because I was like, oh my god, I forgot. I, for I forgot about this getting food, so I was like, so I was like, hopefully we can beat it. And we did, so, yeah, um, killing an uber with spider is not exactly easy, unless you have like 36,000 ants. Or depending which ant species I was playing. I was playing as Gene Beef, which made it easier because we had four ant species. They could have won because they had like um, army ants, so yeah, I couldn't. They couldn't have won, easily, but um, they did. The other colony did win, and both and both colonies survived too. Because usually our the allies end up dying for these missions. And yeah, so if you enjoyed today's episode, you know what to do. Leave a like, subscribe, until next time, I'll see you later. Bye-bye.